How's everybody doing today? Keto family, Matt Troyce here, and today I'm going to be reviewing Briar's Carb Smart Ice Cream. I'm going to be reviewing this, but first, don't forget to hit that subscribe button followed by the bell so you'll be notified every time I release a new video. And also, please feel free to share this out with anybody you feel would benefit from watching this video. Anybody you want, you have my permission. Sharing is caring, guys, and we're all in this together. All right, so let's take a look at the ingredients here. We have milk, maltitol syrup, soluble corn fiber. I have to be honest, not the best ingredients. But if you look at the macros here, a serving size is two thirds of a cup at 110 calories. The total carbohydrate is 17 grams, minus the sugar, alcohol, and dietary fiber of 12 grams, which gives you five grams of net carbs. The five grams of net carbs is coming from three grams of total sugars. Now, to be honest, per serving, this ice cream does fit the macros of a ketogenic lifestyle. If you try to keep under 20 grams of net carbs per day, then this will fit your lifestyle. Some of the ingredients are a deal breaker. I would love for them to use a different sweetener. They are using maltitol and sucralose which can have some impact on your blood sugar. But at the end of the day, if you're just going by net carbs, this will fit into your macros. Also, I like to mention this whole container is about $6. The same price for a pint of Rebel ice cream. Although most of the ingredients in Rebel ice cream are cleaner. So if you're going by price alone, this is definitely a home run. Ingredients, not so much. Let's take a taste test. I'm gonna show you what one serving looks like. All right, so this is one serving of Breyer's Carb Smart Ice Cream. This is two thirds of a cup. So this will net you five grams of net carbs. It's actually not that small of an amount. It looks pretty decent. Now I saw they had vanilla and chocolate. I'm more of a chocolate fan, as you guys know. First off, I just wanna say it's very creamy. I just took it out of the freezer and within minutes it gets very creamy as opposed to most of the keto-friendly ice creams on the market today, which will suggest that you keep your ice cream out of the freezer for about 15 minutes for it to become more creamy. Hmm. I gotta say, this is really delicious. I mean, if you're looking for a keto-friendly ice cream and you're only gonna have one serving of this a day, this is a knockout. This is a home run. The texture, the creaminess, the taste, the smell. This is as close to ice cream as you're gonna get on keto. To be honest, this ice cream may be the best tasting ice cream I've tried following a ketogenic lifestyle. Also, I will mention that this has more net carbs per serving than any of the keto friendly ice creams on the market today as well. So I'm not gonna be eating a whole container of this ice cream like I did with Rebel, but one or two servings a day, I don't see the harm in it. Well, there you have it. That's Breyer's Carb Smart Ice Cream. I would recommend it for anyone following a ketogenic lifestyle. Of course, if you're following a more clean version of keto, I probably wouldn't recommend it based on the ingredient list. You got maltitol, sucralose, milk, and soluble corn fiber, which may impact your blood sugar. But at the end of the day, if you're following net carbs, this will definitely fit into your macros. Just don't go over two servings a day, then you're gonna go way overboard. This is definitely a step in the right direction. I would definitely love to see more options from Briars, perhaps lowering the net carbs and having a better choice of ingredients. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you all be safe and be well. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And feel free to check out any of the three videos I'll link to 
at the end of this video. If you enjoyed this one, I am positive you're gonna enjoy those. Enjoy the rest of your night. Metroid signing out. <laughs>